Now, yeah. I don't know if you'd agree, but I, in talking to you, mostly it's first timers and sometimes kind of that next level crowd, you start talking to them about, okay, well, how much do you need to weigh on, on stage? And especially first timers, like someone my height, they would say, well, I should be like 212 on stage. There's like, I've seen mm-hmm. Bumstead, I've seen <laughs> Arnold. I, I'm smaller, but I, I should be 212. Right. And then, so you're just going to continue to eat <laughs> into the show. <laughs> but then, and then when you get to a show, it's such a wake up call. And, you know, I look at even my first show back, it was in uh, 18. <laughs> and I look at it and it's like, I was still fat then. Like I wasn't even like super lean. And I remember my weight and I think, wow, I can't. Like from the beginning of your prep, I couldn't fathom the weight that I had to get to because my my brain could not be there. Like it wasn't going to do it. And that's part of why at at a bare minimum, you need honest friends Mm -hmm. to say, look, uh, Leo, you're fat. Uh, You have you're going to have to lose 20 pounds. And actually, there was an interesting conversation I had, but or a coach, you know, and they would do it, too. But I had this one guy I was working with and he had to lose so much weight. But in his brain, you could tell like. Just in talking to him, I would say, you know, you still you still probably have to lose 20 pounds now. But in his head, that wasn't yeah. real. And and I think there's this tendency to think, I'm I'm really only about five pounds away. No, yeah. it's more like 25. Take a step back here. <laughs> Brian Whitaker, who's one of the most conditioned natural athletes mm-hmm. of time, he'd say, once you think you're ready, lose another 10 pounds. So that's Woo! generally a good uh, good Woo! rule of thumb. So yeah, Ooh, but yeah, have, having honest friends around. Having a good coach who can kind of keep you objective is is definitely key. And don't focus on that scale weight, right? You can't say, hey, this athlete over here who's been competing for 30 years is this weight, but we're about the same height. You know, you can't ever compare yourself to anyone. So just kind of throw out the the scale with the sense of having something to kind of hit and just use it as a guide more than anything. Because then next time you've got something to compare yourself to because you've already done it before.